name is Parson Silva. I am a commissioner of police, working for the Gambia Police Force. I started banking with Trust Bank since its inception. Because I started with the Commercial and Development Bank from Liman Street, then we were moved and Trust Bank, Trust Bank Limited inherited us from Commercial and Development Bank. Since then I had been banking with the Trust Bank Limited since its inception. The service delivery has been very, very good. I can say I have benefited so many loans from the bank, since Commercial Bank up to Trust Bank Limited. And I've been enjoying so many facilities. Like, I once brought in a container and I found it difficult to clear it and immediately I walked into the bank, I was just asked to produce a collateral and the container was out. After two months it was paid. And you know, so many facilities have been offered to me. Once I had to, I had planned to go to England with my son and I shot, got shot out of um, money. But when I walked into the bank, I just drew out a check and it was endorsed. And my journey was so swift and, you know, I was made to pay that loan, you know, at a very, very minimal rate. Well, I would advise them to stay with the bank because they are very reliable. It is Gambian-owned bank and banking with the Trust Bank, no one will ever regret banking with them. And also, when you are in problems, you face them, they will give you advice and will try to solve your pro um, problems as soon as possible. So I welcome every customer who has not yet come on board to please come on board you know, and start banking with Trust Bank Limited. And with the bank, I would just urge them to keep up the good momentum, to continue to be sympathetic with their customers. And in so doing, they will gain more customers than any other bank in the Gambia. It is our own Gambian bank, and the, the member staff from the director, general, um, general manager or directors are very polite and they have very good customer relationship. So I would urge everyone to make sure they come and bank with Trust Bank Limited. They would never regret it. Well, viewers, I would urge all of you who has not yet started banking with the Trust Bank Limited to come on, come on board. Trust Bank Limited is the most reliable bank. They are sympathetic and their service delivery ex is exemplary. So I would urge all viewers to make sure they come and bank with our own Gambian bank, which is the Trust Bank Limited. and I work at the corporate banking department here in Trust Bank. I've started working here since 2010 when I completed my studies in the UK. My job um, is a corporate accounts officer. I usually deal with customers of the bank, that's individual customers, corporate customers of Trust Bank. I studied banking with economics and law and I also have a master's degree in business administration. When I was a student, I was expecting to work in a bank or in the financial service sector. So my background was centered around, around that and it, that involves studying something that's related to banking or something that's related to the finance world. Working here, you expected to deal with different people from different ethnic backgrounds and dealing with those people, you have to bring yourself to their level because not all the customers are banking oriented or they need what they understand what they need in the bank 
So you really have to help the customer, guide the customer, and help them with their daily banking activities. You come through so many challenges daily, and that involves like meeting a customer that is not happy with banking products. And basically, we just have to deal with the customer, explain to the customer so the customer understands what is expected and what they need. So by doing so, you'll be able to teach the customer what banking is all about so that they'll be able to understand and come around with our terms and conditions. Every day is challenging. Every day is challenging. You meet different customers and customers come here very moody. You know, you get to a point that customer can insult you, that you, you cannot do your job properly and that's really annoying and it's really frustrating at times. But at the end of the day, you just have to realize that you're here to serve the people and this is why you're here. So, basically it's just about motivation. Managing my budget like and coming to work is hectic, I can say. Because I have two kids at the moment and leaving them at home, coming to work, something <laughs> very challenging but at the end of the day this is my career I have a career that I really want to develop and I have family so I just have to cope with both situations you can be managing your home and be managing your career at the same time you just have to multitask <laughs> basically yeah even when I come to work I have to be calling at home to check if my kids are okay if everything is all right with them so it's just about multitasking and career development also is very important. One has to be aware that, you know, without your career, then you can't be anybody. Yeah. So it's always very important to think analytically and, you know, develop your home and develop yourself. The young women like me, I think these days now, women are very, very aware that education is the key to success. So I am urging everyone to take their education seriously and make sure that everything is done without fear or um, being able to um, believe in themselves and make sure that they can achieve anything. If you work hard, you will achieve your goals. And I believe myself that that is possible for everyone. My future lies in my present. <laughs> so. Determination, determination. I am very determined and I can work under pressure. So with these um, capabilities that I have in me and the belief that I have in me, I think I can excel to where I want to be in the future. This world we're in now is like so revolving and it involves business and economics as you said. The economy is growing and I must tell them that this is the present and now the future. The future will be will be depending on them. So they will be the leaders of tomorrow. Say so they they now have to work hard for tomorrow. So let them do their education. Listen carefully to their parents and they will be the leaders of tomorrow. Je suis venu à la maison. 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 Je suis venu à la 